Hello everyone, in this video we are going to discuss about the, the difference between the gate wall versus ball wall. So there are so many similarities between the gate wall and ball wall but there are also so many differences between the gate wall and ball walls that we are going to discuss in this video right and we have already uploaded the each video about the gate wall as well as the ball wall if you haven't watched that video please watch that video in the industrial walls playlist so in this video we are going to discuss about the the differences between the both the walls so before starting the video here you can see simply the pen id symbol of the gate wall this is the simple manual gate wall and this is this PNID symbol of the your ball wall okay this is the symbol of the ball wall that is the manual ball wall and this is the control wall okay control wall which is a ball type so now let's start the video with first difference between the gate wall and ball wall so the first difference is that the gate wall is a linear motion wall and ball wall is a rotary motion wall so whenever we classify the wall so we classify the walls in two parts okay the first one is linear motion walls and the second one is rotary motion walls so what is the meaning of it okay i'll tell you the meaning simply you can see here in the case of the gate wall here you will see the wheel okay here you will see the wheel okay which is connected to the stem right in the case of the ball wall here you will see along with the stem you will see the handle okay so what is the difference between them to open or close the gate wall there is the wheel which you rotate 360 okay or which you rotate clockwise or anti-clockwise right but in the case of the ball wall because this is a rotary motion wall so it means that it it is a quarter turn wall means it will always open at the 90 degree right it will open like that okay it will open at the 90 degree but in the case of the gate wall it is a linear wall means whenever you will rotate it so it will open linearly are you getting my point what i want to say please see the picture here see these are your gate wall okay these are your gate wall okay so whenever you have to open or close the wall what you have to do you have to simply turn it clockwise or anti-clockwise to open or close the gate wall but in the case of the ball wall this is your quarter turn wall or this is your rotary type of the wall so there is the handle right so now what will happen that simply whenever you have to close or open it so simply you will rotate this handle at the 90 degree are you getting my point what i want to say at this case your wall is open and at this case your wall is also open but when it will be like that the handle will be like that it means that your wall is closed right now gate wall is a multi-turn wall and ball wall is a quarter turn wall what is the meaning of it it means that whenever you have to open the gate wall so you will have to rotate it clockwise or anti-clockwise right so it means that you will have to rotate it at the 360 degree right but in the case of the ball wall it is a quarter turn wall so whenever you have to open or close it whenever i am saying you have to open it at the 90 degree it means that simply you are whether you are closing it or you are opening it or means whether you are closing it 100 percent or you are opening it 100 percent right so it means that this is your quarter turn wall means simply there will be the handle right so whenever you are simply moving this handle at the 90 degree it means that your wall will be closed and whenever you are turning this handle to the 90 degree it means that your wall will be open right that also we have already discussed right now if i talk about the gate wall so in the case of the gate wall there is the solid disc okay this is your disc of the gate wall this is your disc right so why this what is the use of this disc simply whenever you like right now your fluid is not following right why because this disc is placed at the seat this disc is placed at the seat that's why and you can simply say that this disc is a heart of the any wall okay 
this disc is a heart of the wall so whenever you have to open it means whenever this disc or whenever this disc will go upward like that here right now your wall is completely open so what will happen that simply your flow will go like that your flow will go like that are you getting my point what i want to say so that's i want to tell you that in the case of the gate wall it has a solid disc and it moves vertically to open or close the orifice means whenever you have to open or close the orifice orifice means this space right so what will happen that simply this disc will go upward and downward right here you can say simply the stem is going upward okay and this wheel in this case the wheel is fixed right now let's see what happens in the ball wall case so in the ball wall case there is a hollow ball this is your hollow ball this is your ball okay this is the disc in the case of the ball wall the hollow ball is a disc right and it rotates inside the wall horizontally so whenever you have to open or close the ball wall so the the hollow ball will rotate horizontally are you getting my point what i want to say okay so this is the another difference between the gate wall and ball wall now if i talk about the durability so the gate wall is not durable as as compared to the ball wall after the long period of disuse okay there are so many lines which is just open okay like in the in the shutdown you can say or in the startup you can say or there are so many so many lines which only only open or close after many times right so in that case the gate walls are not that much suitable right in that case the ball walls are most probably preferable are you getting my point what i want to say to so the ball walls are durable and reliable after a long period of disuse right there are so many like i have seen that there are some simply you can say the leakage problem occurs that time okay whenever if we use the gate wall that time right so that time most of the time i have seen that we use the ball walls right now the gate walls are typically used in the larger line size okay means mainly we prefer the gate walls where the larger size of the lines are right this mechanism or this video which we are like discussing right now that is discussing with respect to industrial point of view i am not saying that the gate walls cannot be used in a smaller line size yes it is used but whenever you have to select the walls right so that scenario we are considering here right and this is also the my personal experience as well as i have also like commissioned so many plants so that's why i am telling you okay and can sustain high pressure than the ball wall with respect to pressure point of view and with respect to the line size point of view so with respect to line size point of view okay it it is used in the larger line size and it also can sustain the higher pressure same if i talk about the ball wall so ball walls are typically used in a smaller line size right and cannot handle the high pressure as compared to the gate wall that's why you will see mainly in the cooling water line we mainly see the gate walls right there are also other application as well right so this is the another difference between the gate wall and ball wall now let's see the other difference between the both the walls so now the other difference is that the gate walls are commonly used in the liquid and gaseous line right now the ball if i talk about the ball walls so ball walls are better suitable for the liquid handling mainly in the sludge line or mainly in the other liquid line you will see that we use the ball walls ball walls are also used in the you are like if i talk about the application point of view so the gate wall is used in the slurries viscous application cooling water application you will see the gate wall right but if i talk about the ball wall mainly the ball wall is used as a emergency safety wall quick shut down wall as well as in the slurries line also i have seen the ball wall now you can say that sir gate wall is using in a viscous application i have also seen the ball walls also yes it could be there 
बट द मेजर एप्लीकेशन ऑफ द बॉल वॉल इज एज ए एमरजेंसी सेफ्टी वॉल एंड क्विक शट डाउन वॉल वाई लेट सपोज इफ देर इज एनी फ्लूड इज फ्लोइंग राइट एंड देर इज द बॉल वॉल वाई यू आर वाई यू आर यूजिंग द बॉल वॉल देयर एज अ एमरजेंसी सेफ्टी वॉल और क्विक सेफ्टी वॉल बिकॉज लेट सपोज इफ द प्लांट और लेट सपोज इफ डेट फ्लूड इज टॉक्सिक एंड वट यू वॉन्ट इफ एनी थिंग मिस हैपनिंग हैपन सो डेट फ्लूड सिंपली इंटरप्ट और वट यू वॉन्ट यू वॉन्ट डेट डेट फ्लूड डजेंट गो टू दी डाउन स्ट्रीम सो वट यू विल डू यू कैन सिंपली यूज दी बॉल वॉल Now, why the ball wall used as a emergency safety wall or quick shut down wall? Because it is a rotary type of the wall. It is a quarter turn wall. Simply, there is the handle. There is the simply there is the handle. So, what you have to do? Simply, you have to clog. You have to simply turn this wall at the ninety degree, and your wall will be closed, right? So that's why we use this wall as a emergency safety wall or quick shut down wall. I hope you got my point. now the another difference is that the gate wall is used to achieve maximum flow rate than ball wall what is the meaning of it simply if let's suppose if you want to achieve the maximum flow rate okay like during the during the your wall opening so simply you can use the gate wall and ball wall also achieve a maximum flow rate maximum flow rate means with respect to the your line diameter or With respect to your line size, okay. So whenever this wall will be hundred percent open, ball wall, it will also achieve the maximum flow rate. And whenever it will be hundred percent open, so the delta P will be less. Same in the case of the gate wall. Whenever your gate wall will be hundred percent open, so delta P will be will be less. Now there is the one question for you all. when the both walls gate walls and ball walls are 100% open now which wall have the higher delta p please let me in the comments box which which wall will have higher delta p right so this is the question for you all now with respect to the cost point of view gate walls are cheaper and ball walls are comparatively costlier right if we talk about the same size so simply the gate walls will be cheaper and the ball wall will be your comparatively costlier right gate wall using the multi turn mechanism that we have already discussed and the ball walls is a quarter turn wall now if we talk about the weight point of view so simply the gate wall weight is comparatively less as compared to the ball wall if the sizing is the same if the size is same but in the case of the ball wall simply the ball wall have a relatively higher weight as compared to the gate wall if the rating and the size is a same right now the gate wall doesn't capable of shut off comparatively ball walls that we have also discussed okay because this is the quarter turn wall that's why here is the shut off application is better or very very good one okay in the case of the ball walls that we have discussed because in the ball wall what happens that there is the the construction is modified okay there is the hollow balls okay then there is the another mechanism like seal stem is there that's why with respect to the ball a uh, gate wall the gate walls construction is very simple right because there is the wheel and the stem and then the disc that's why what we have that's why we are saying that it is a cheaper and less weight than the ball wall now let's see the other differences between the both the walls okay so the gate wall cannot be used as a control wall i haven't seen gate wall as a control wall okay ball wall can be used as a control wall that i have seen like in the air line i have seen in the compressor section as well as in the off site section also in the off site plant i have seen the ball wall as a control wall and in the case of the ball wall whenever the ball wall will be used as a control wall so you will see that its actuator will be horizontal okay please see this in a industry if you find the ball wall as a control wall please let me in the comments box whether this is the right or not right now the gate walls requires 
usually less space in operation and if i talk about the ball wall so it require more space in, in operation why because in the case of the gate walls there is the wheel okay you have to simply rotate the wheel to open or close it but in the case of the ball wall there is the handle so whenever you have to open or close the ball wall so you require to move the handle right so that's why this is what am i telling that in the case of the ball walls you require more space right now see the next it produce in the case of the gate wall it produce vibration in the partial opening simply whenever it if it will be partially open so what will happen that there will be the vibration and the chattering could be there right but in the case of the ball wall the possibility of vibration and noise is less than less in ball wall why because when because there is the hollow okay this is the hollow means the ball is hollow ball right the disc is hollow ball and whenever you will open it partially so in the case of the ball ball the possibility is less vibration could be there but with comparison to the gate ball it is less right and in the last in operation the gate wall is slow minor chance of liquid hammer in the case of the ball wall the ball walls are more chance of the liquid hammer most of the time what, what i have seen that in the case of the ball walls the liquid hammering is more okay the liquid hammering the chattering that you can say that is more when it is partially open let's suppose the 70 percent 60 percent it is open but in the case of the gate wall simply it is slow why it is slow because you have to open it 90 degree what you have to do in why it is slow because you have there is the wheel and you have to rotate the wheel 360 degree right and uh, you have to multiple times you have to rotate the wheel right that's why we are saying that it is a gate wall is a slow but the ball wall is not slow it is a very fast right so that is the video about the gate wall versus ball wall if you have any doubt in this video or if you if if any points didn't clear to you please let me in the comments box i'll definitely clear your doubt as soon as possible so that's all for the today's video thanks for watching till then keep learning thank you